The problem with international motor shows is that your company's stand must be more impressive than your rivals. Mercedes have really pulled out the stops at Paris with video and internet posts and a turntable which doesn't just turn a car but virtually the whole stand. But the reason why the crowds had gathered today was the unveiling of the Mercedes F200 concept car. This is a dream model loaded with gadgets which the designers really think will be in our showrooms in the next century. This is the product of some of the finest brains in German engineering and design, and it shows. The most amazing concepts can be found in the cabin, where the steering wheel and pedals are gone. You steer with a central joystick, moving it left or right, and you accelerate by pushing forward. You brake by pulling it back. There are no crude wires from the joystick, or messages are sent electronically. Your rear view mirror is replaced by a video screen. Here's the camera lens at the back. The out and over doors designed to help getting in and out are opened by the car, sensing a magnetic card in the owner's pocket. No swiping, no blipping even. If you think that's clever, even the headlights have variable light distribution, giving out extra light as the speed of the car increases and also adjust depending on front wheel turning angle. This gives you maximum light when cornering at night. The boot lid levers up with the help of two electric motors and a four-joint hinge, giving maximum loading space. On the move, the Mercedes F200 constantly monitors speed, pitch and roll, and onboard processors then sends messages to the car to smooth out the ride by use of an active spring and damper adjustment system. If you hope to see this delectable concept at the NEC show in Birmingham, sorry, but it will still be in Paris. So take a last look now.